Ever since this old country vaquero grill took the place of my pizza oven in the barbecue back shack, I knew I would use it often. Six months later, and we have yet to do any modifications to it. Today, however, that changes. We are mounting and setting up Only Fire's universal rotisserie kit. So if you're an old country vaquero owner or are thinking about buying one, this video will show you just how to do this. Okay, so let's get started. You will need a drill, a marker, a tape measure, a straight edge, and later on a grinder or Dremel. So grab your tape measure and marker so that we can install these two mounting brackets from the kit. First, we measure five inches from the top of the firebox along the edge of the wheel beam holders. Then we draw a straight line across the beam. Do this on both sides of the firebox as we will line the bottom of the mounting brackets with these lines. Next, we will line up the brackets to the lines and drill two small holes in the middle slots of the brackets. We did this on both sides. A total of four number eight three quarter of an inch screws are needed to install these brackets on both ends. These are about 50 cents at your local Walmart. Utilize the washers included in the kit as well. Next, we will need to cut out this area from the bracket with a grinder or Dremel. Our first cut was too small for the rotating piece of the spit rod. So we cut out just a little bit more and it worked out just perfect. And now to test the mounting of the motor. The motor has two grooves that just slide into the mounting bracket. And on the other end is where the spit rod is inserted. And now to assemble the spit rod. We first screw together the two pieces of the spit rod. Next we slide in the two claws that will hold our proteins. And the next thing is to screw down the rotating piece, followed by the counterweight balance. Finally, we are done. Now this rotation of the spit rod could be quite mesmerizing. And next we will test to make sure the mounts do not affect the functionality of the grill. All seems good. The mounting of the brackets five inches above the firebox allows us to utilize the grill just below the spit rod so that we can cook meat along the side of the rotisserie and still give us enough space to tend to the fire. It also allows the grill to be above the spit rod so that we can utilize a dome or a cover above our proteins. In our next video we will be trying the rotisserie probably on some yard bird and we will be trying this uh, meat stick, the meat stick X rotisserie. So that will be the next review along with this first cook. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And as always, thank you for watching.